Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy at your homes. I am your GK teacher, Ms. Farheen, and I welcome you all to your GK class. So, my dear students, today I will give you a complete review of unit number 5. As you know that we have covered all the reading pages, we have done the exercise pages. So, today will be a review of unit number 5. So, the name of your unit number 5 is Places of Worship in the Neighborhood. As you all remember that, I know that. So, before moving on towards our review, let's recap what we have done in lesson number 4. As you all remember that lesson number 4 was all about a project that we visited a mosque, masjid and we observed different activities over there, we observed different behaviors over there. So, let's quickly answer some questions and recap your and refresh your previous lesson. So, quickly tell me, name different activities of masjid. Okay, whenever you visit a masjid, what are the different activities that you observe over there? Yes, think, yes, uh, people are saying their prayers, they recite Holy Quran and they stay quiet over there. So, these are different activities that happening that are happening in the masjid whenever we visit there. And the next question is, how do we behave in masjid? So, do you remember that when we did the project, we went to the masjid and what was uh, the behavior? that we observed over there. How, what was your behavior when you were in the masjid? You were quiet. You didn't take your shoes inside. This is also a, a way to respect masjid. Then um, you did wuzu. Whenever we visit masjid, we must uh, do wuzu, uh, clean ourselves, clean our face. This is called wuzu. Whenever we say our prayers, we do wuzu. And then what are the other, other things that people, uh, how do people behave? They remain silent, they do not run and whenever we visit masjid, we must wear neat and clean clothes. So, these are the different um, behaviors that are observed in a masjid. Okay, now quickly move forward with me. Let's quickly revise our student learning outcomes which are given on page number 37 and this, these are for the parents and the teachers to understand that now all the students are able to identify the masjid in their neighborhood as a place of worship for Muslims. They are able to inquire about other places of worship, church, temple, gurdwara. And they are also able to recognize that they should respect all places of worship and all religions. So, my dear students, let's quickly look at the Islamic perspectives that we discussed with the student learning outcomes. So, the Prophet, peace be upon him, said uh, the parts of land dearest to Allah are its mosques. So, my dear students, uh, the place of worship for Muslims is masjid. So, Allah Ta'ala ke nizdeek jo sab se piyari jaga hai, jis se Allah Ta'ala ko bohut zyada mohabbat hai, wo masjid hai. Okay, then next, the Prophet, peace be upon him, said the best aspect of Iman is patience and tolerance. So, my dear students, just like Muslims have their place of worship like masjid, there are other religions, dusre mazhab bhi hain, jo ke apni ibadat ki jagahon pe jate hain, jaysay ke church mein Christians jate hain, gurdwara mein Sikh jate hain, aur mandir mein Hindu jate hain. I know you all remember that. Or Muslimano ka kaam kya hai? Ya hamari zemedari sirf Muslimano ki ni har insan ki zemedari kya hai? Ke usko tamam uh, places of worship jo hai, unki izzat karni hai aur ehtaram bhi karna hai. Or Nabi Pak sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam ne hame bataya hai ke iman ka sabse behtareen uh, mazboot iman wala shaks wo hai jiske andar bardasht hai aur tahammul hai. To hame दूसरे मजाहब के मजाहब की इबादत की जगहों का भी इज्जत और एहतराम करना चाहिए इससे हमारे अंदर बर्दाश्त और सबर पैदा होता है ओके नाउ लेट्स क्विकली मूव टुवर्ड्स आवर रीडिंग पेजेस लेट्स क्विकली रिवाइज व्हाट वी हैव डन हियर ऑन पेज नंबर 38 वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट दैट द प्लेस फॉर द मुस्लिम्स टू वर्शिप इज अ मस्जिद 
uh, there is azan that happens in the masjid five times a day and Muslims go to masjid to offer prayer and recite, learn and recite Holy Quran and everyone has a masjid in their neighborhood. So this is what we did on page number 38. This was a recap and review of page number 38. Now quickly answer a few questions. They are related to page number 38. Quickly tell me what is a masjid? What is a masjid? Quickly tell me. I know you know the answer. Quickly think and answer. What is a masjid? Kiski jagah hai ye ibadat ki? Kaun yaha worship karta hai? Yes. Masjid is a place of worship for the Muslims. Excellent. Now, quickly tell me why do people go to masjid? Ham masjid kya karne jate hai? Musliman kyu masjid jate hai? Jab paanch dafa azan hoti hai, toh ham masjid mein kya karne jate hai? Aapke father and your grandfather, why do they go to masjid? To offer their prayers. Very nice. Namaz padhne jate hai. Okay, where do Muslims offer prayers? Muslims offer their prayers in the masjid. Excellent. Now, page number 38 again and this time we will do the second paragraph. Here is the second paragraph. I have zoomed in. in. Let, let me erase this. Okay. Places of worship. Okay, my dear students. So, we have Muslims ki worship ki jagah ka par liya, ibadat ki jagah ka par liya, ke musulman kaha ja rahe hai ibadat ke liye, masjid mein ja rahe hai. Toh joh dousre loog hai, joh ke musulman nahi hai, kabhi aapne socha ke woh kaha jate hai ibadat karne ke liye, unki apni ibadat ki jagah hoti hai, they have their own places of worship. Aur hum ab uske baare mein padhenge, as muslims we have a place to worship, similarly, the people, of other religions have a place of worship too. Jaise ke Christians worship in a church. Then, Sikhs worship in Gurdwara. This is a Gurdwara. And Hindus worship in Mandir. To ye different religions hain. These are different religions. Aur in ki place of, places of worship ye hain. Church, Gurdwara and Mandir. Okay? So, these different uh, jo religions hai, unki jo hai, wo worship places. Hai. This is what we read on page number 38 and page number 39. So, quickly answer a few questions which are related to page number 38 and 39. Tell the name of other places of worship. Now, we have revised you. So, as a masjid, ke ilawa, Dusri places of worship jo hai, unke naam batayin. Number one, church. Number two, gurdwara. Number three, mandir. Excellent. Okay. Who goes to church for worship? Ab church koon jata hai ibadat karne ke liye? Very good. Christians. Who goes to gurdwara for worship? Very nice. Sikh goes to gurdwara for worship. Who goes to Mandir for worship? Hindus go to uh, Mandir for worship. Very good. Okay, now page number 39 and there comes the second paragraph of it. Let me zoom it in and raise the line. There you go. Okay, so we discussed about different places of worship on page number 38 and page number 39. So now, according to the student learning outcome, फिर हमने ये पढ़ा था कि हमें उन तमाम जगाओं की, तमाम places of worship की इज्जत और एहतराम भी करना है. We must respect all the places of worship. Masjid, church, uh, mandir, gurdwara. Okay? The respect of religious places. So, uh, all places... Mandir, church, gurdwara are places of worship. Ye humne pada. Aur uske baad humne pada ke musalman jo hain, wo uh, respect karte hain uh, apni ibadat ki jaga ki, jaysay ke masjid. To masjid mein loog kaise jate hain? Wo wahaan shor nahi karte, saaf kapde pahente hain, 
इसके अलावा मस्जिद को भी दे कीप इट नीट एंड क्लीन सो दिस आर दीज आर द डिफरेंट थिंग्स दैट वी रेड अबाउट रिस्पेक्टिंग रिलीजियस प्लेसेस तो इसी तरह जब हम दूसरे मजहब की प्लेसेस ऑफ वर्शिप की रिस्पेक्ट करते हैं तो उससे क्या चीज होती है उससे इट क्रिएट्स पीस इन द सोसाइटी ठीक है तो जब आप दूसरे मजहब के लोगों की प्लेसेस ऑफ वर्शिप की इज्जत करेंगे तो इस तरीके से सोसाइटी में पीस बढ़ेगा बनेगा ठीक है नफरत कम हो जाएगी और अमन व सकून पैदा होगा ठीक है क्योंकि अगर आप किसी को बुरा कहेंगे या किसी की इज्जत नहीं करेंगे तो इससे तो लड़ाई झगड़ा होता है इट क्रिएट्स फाइट इट क्रिएट्स डिस्टर्बेंस एंड हेटेड तो मोहब्बत और पीस बनाने के लिए आपको हर किसी का एहतराम करना है हर किसी की प्लेस ऑफ वर्शिप की रिस्पेक्ट करनी है इज दैट क्लियर ओके क्विकली आंसर अ फ्यू क्वेश्चन विच आर रिलेटेड टू पेज नंबर थर्टी एट एंड रिस्पेक्ट टू प्लेस डिफरेंट रिलीजियस रिलीजियस वर्शिप प्लेसेज हाउ शुड बी बिहेव इन मस्जिद तो आप मस्जिद में कैसे बिहेव करते हैं क्विकली टेल मी यस नो नॉइज नो रनिंग वेयर नीट एंड क्लीन क्लोथ एंड कीप द मस्जिद सराउंडिंग क्लीन एक्सेलेंट ओके How should we behave at other relig- uh, places of worship? We must uh, behave respectfully in the uh, other pl- uh, on other places of worship. Okay? Why should we respect all religions? We must respect all religions because it creates peace in the society. Very good. How can we keep peace in our society by respecting all worship? places or by um, by respecting worship places of all religions tamam ibadat ki jagahein jo hain dusre mazhab ki unki izzat karne se society mein amn o sukoon paida hota hai okay okay my dear students name the largest masjid of pakistan pakistan ki sabse badi masjid ka naam bataye i told you this do you remember shah faisal mosque or it is also called faisal masjid shah faisal masjid or faisal masjid jo hai pakistan ki sabse badi masjid hai and where it is situated it is in islamabad okay now your assessment time your worksheet number 3 will be given to you by your teacher in print form and this is how you will be evaluated mujhe pata chal jayega aapki teacher ko pata chal jayega ki bachcho ne kitna kuch sikha hai Okay there are few questions you have to write down your name over here and then you will write down your class over here okay question number 1 let me read the question for you you will do it yourself name the worship places and the pictures so there are two places of worship over here you have to write down their names underneath them inke niche inke naam likhe quickly do it make sure that you have written the correct spellings and write it in neat neat and clean handwriting question number 2 who worships in mandir mandir mein kaun ibadat karta hai you will write down your answer in this line okay quickly do it okay now move forward who worships in gurdwara question number 3 अब गुरुद्वारे में कौन जो है इबादत करता है यू हैव टू राइट इट डाउन अंडर नीथ द क्वेश्चन देन कम्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर हाउ शुड बी बिहेव इन मस्जिद सो यू हैव टू राइट थ्री बिहेवियर्स और एनी टू बिहेवियर्स इन दीज लाइन्स मिनिमम टू कम अज कम आपको दो बिहेवियर्स लिखने ओके देन कम्स रिस्पेक्टिंग द नंबर फाइव रिस्पेक्टिंग द रिलीजियस प्लेसेज ऑफ अदर्स कॉज हेटेड और पीस यू हैव टू सर्कल द करेक्ट ऑप्शन दूसरी प्लेसेस ऑफ वर्शिप जो है उनकी इज्जत और एहतराम करने से नफरत पैदा होती है या सकून अमन और सकून पैदा होता है सो यू हैव टू सर्कल द करेक्ट ऑप्शन यू कैन पॉज द वीडियो एंड यू कैन फिनिश योर असेसमेंट देन यू हैव टू गो टू योर टीचर फॉर चेकिंग एंड मार्किंग ऑल्सो सो आई होप एवरीबडी हैज डन द वर्कशीट असेसमेंट वर्कशीट Now your homework for today is read page number thirty eight and page number thirty nine. So just a reading uh, homework. आपको book खोलनी है page number thirty eight read out करना है. 
एंड देन पेज नंबर थर्टी नाइन रीड आउट करना है दिस विल एनहांस योर रीडिंग स्किल्स ओके नाउ वट हैव आई लर्न इन दिस यूनिट हमने यूनिट नंबर फाइव में क्या क्या कुछ सीखा मस्जिद इज अ प्लेस ऑफ वर्शिप ऑफ मुस्लिम मुस्लिम ऑफर प्रेयर इन मस्जिद चर्च इज अ प्लेस ऑफ वर्शिप ऑफ क्रिश्चन हिंदूज वर्शिप इन मंदिर एंड सिक्स वर्शिप इन गुरुद्वारा सो दीज आर ऑल द पॉइंट दैट यू हैव लर्न बाई नाउ ओके लेट्स रैप अप द लेसन नाउ ऑल ऑफ यू आर एबल टू डिस्क्राइब डिफरेंट एक्टिविटीज हैपनिंग इन मस्जिद अब आप ये बात बता सकते हैं कि मस्जिद में क्या क्या करते हैं एंड यू नो नेम्स ऑफ डिफरेंट वर्शिप प्लेसेस इसके अलावा आपको डिफरेंट प्लेसेस ऑफ वर्शिप के नेम्स भी पता चल गए हैं एंड यू आर एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट यू मस्ट ऑल रिस्पेक्ट ऑल प्लेसेस ऑफ वर्शिप और आप अब ये बात भी जान चुके हैं कि आपको तमाम इबादत की जगहें चाहे वो चर्च है मंदिर है गुरुद्वारा है आपको सबकी इज्जत करनी है ओके हाउ डू वी बिहेव इन मस्जिद आपको यह भी पता चल गया है वी मस्ट रिमेन क्वाइट रिस्पेक्टफुल परफॉर्म वजू बिफोर प्रेयर एंड रेसिटेशन टेक ऑफ शूज बिफोर एंटरिंग इन टू मस्जिद एंड नो रनिंग इन द मस्जिद सो दीज आर ऑल द पॉइंट दैट यू नो दैट दिस इज हाउ यू शुड बिहेव इन द मस्जिद so my dear students i hope you have enjoyed the video and you have learned a lot of things from unit number 5 and you will follow these points also in your daily routine keep everybody around you safe have a good day thank you so much and allah hafiz